Hi guys, I'm Jojo Astro Barbie from your love, Talam, and this is Angel, and we love you. Welcome to your weekly horoscope. This week the sun is in the sign of Libra. Yes, starting Saturday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. You are the sign of beauty and peace, and we love you for that. And this year, and next year, the year after, mm -mm, very good for you. At the same time, we also welcome the Fall Equinox. It's very, very special. That means for the next four weeks, the energies will be much more loving, more compassionate, more apathy, more fair, and also putting with a tendency to really give and putting other people first. So it's important to really learn to receive this week, to say no to what is not worthy to us, situations or people. Look also for a fair exchange in all our relationships. And we're talking personally, collectively and even in the world. The Fall Equinox brings also equal days and nights, a perfect balance between the dark and the light, and a very good week, therefore, to check our own balance in our own life. How are we doing with the feminine, the masculine, the light, the dark, the shadow, and our brightness? And it's very important this week to really, really take stock of what we want to accomplish for the next few years and make all necessary changes. Go to the bottom of it. Be honest with yourself and other people. That's the best way in all relationships this week. And I'm telling you, we will be able to manifest one. Justice, peace, love, and harmony. Oh, it feels so good, harmony. This week, the moon travels in the sign of and of Aquarius, Pisces, Aries, and Taurus. On Monday, it's Sukkot that begins for our Jewish friends. And we have the biggest news of the week this week. Ooh la la, we have a harvest bigger than usual. Fabulous orange full moon in passionate areas from all things. That means influenced by Mars. So we will feel very, very uh, sexy, charming. Our libido is going to be high. Uh, will feel very romantic, loving, and we will want to express ourselves in a very dramatic way. It makes us very, very romantic and loving. So if you're single, go out because you definitely could call in love. And also, spiritual values are heightened and we're more understanding, we have more compassion with people. So altogether, this is a very pleasant week. It is more human, more heart, less mind. On Monday also, we have something very important. The, it's the moon in Aries also making a square. Square is always a challenge, but remember in the universe, nothing is bad. The dark is always the shadow of the light, okay? So it's making a square to Saturn, planet of wisdom, telling us to really take full responsibility for our actions and make things right for ourselves, the people we love in the world, and we will see this personally, collectively, and also in the world affairs. And from, from this week, you will see. Nobody could feel anybody in life. What goes around, comes around in all things. And it's always for the purpose of learning our lessons. It means this week we will see how good we are doing and how we need to do better in some other area. And that goes also politically. Libra, Libra, happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you. The full moon in your relationship sector brings peace of mind, excitement in your life. You're doing really good. Just continue to do all the changes you've been undertaking and just continue in that flow. In career, you're definitely brilliant and smart. You're on top of things, optimistic, ambitious. You get things done like a champion. Leo, Gemini, and Cancers definitely have your back. And on the weekend, you receive lots of gratitude and it feels great. Your magical color turquoise like in numbers 6 and 15. Scorpio, Scorpio, the full moon in your work sector brings you a big boost of energy. The winds of good fortune are blowing in your sails and you feel it. This is a perfect week to really push on your goals and your dreams. In health, beauty, your appearance, your wardrobe, career, your finances. A good week also to make some kind of a, maybe a connection with your accountant or financial advisor. You could get good deals. And in your personal life, it's a very, very important to connect with a special person 
that could really help you move mountains. So it's like you do things with another person this week to really get where you are, okay? So you have a special friend or family member, so take advantage. The rewards are definitely guaranteed whatever you do, so just do it. On the weekend, relax, pamper yourself, go and buy yourself something just for you. Taurus and Cancers and Aries definitely show they care. Your magical color, Fuchsia, lucky number 7 and 25. Sagittarius, the full moon in your creative sector make you very powerful, charming, inventive, and lucky. The world is offering you infinite possibilities, my dear. Take your time and decide what you want to accomplish. Not for your ego, but for long-term vitality and happiness for you and loved ones. Hmm? On the weekend, meditation, sport activities, in nature, and yoga all help you to focus and to feel better. Your magical color red, lucky numbers, eight, and 44. Capricorn, the full moon in your home sector brings you a second breath. You feel very close to family members. Definitely you feel hope is in the air in your personal life and also at work. Your understanding, your perseverance helps you accomplish a lot of good stuff. In love, keep your thoughts positive, never confirm the negative. And please don't tell your age, especially ladies, come on. You do not tell your age because in life, you manifest the age that you say you are. Okay, guys too. Be clear of what you want in love, dream big, and let the universe handle the details. Never put time and space in your dreams, okay? The universe knows best. On the weekend, speed spread your wings and fly high, my sweetheart. You deserve it. Your magical color blue lucky numbers 9 and 13. Ta-da! Aquarius, the full moon in your communication sector, bring you good fortune and charm. You may have many questions in your mind about your life. What do you want to do in the next four or five years from now? People admire you for your originality, creativity, and good heart. A good time also to explore, meditate, reinvent, and do things differently in your life and just create it the way you want. Okay, happiness is guaranteed if you do. I knew you will. Women are definitely allies and play an important role in your life this week and on the weekend. Love is definitely in the air. If you're single or married, do something romantic. The full moon fluffs your wings. Ooh, lucky you. Your magical color, purple, lucky numbers, one and 55. I see spices. The full moon in your spiritual sector gives you wings. Get ready for a new adventure in all of your life. It's a new paradigm. You know why? Because you know what you don't want, therefore you know what you want. And that's pretty cool. Take a risk. Your success, your joy is guaranteed. At work, you could connect with people in a special way. In love, it's all about giving what you want to receive. Okay? The focus is also on faith, believing in yourself with all your might, and really expressing your true, original, authentic you. Don't worry what people think. Positive thinking and getting things done using your charm, your wit, your magic is the way to go. Have faith in yourself because everything you touch right now could turn into gold. Touch me, touch me, Pisces. On the weekend, you're loved for who you are and not for what you have. Isn't that cool? The magical color is lilac, lucky numbers, 2 and 11. Ta-da! Aries, the full moon in your sign, you're the start of the week, brings changes, new opportunities to move in the new exciting direction, especially in your personal life. Expect lots of activities in love, affirm yourself, say absolutely no more to certain people that have not treated you properly lately. You have to move on. Your life is a bouncing, bouncing kind of energy right now, but you are moving forward and you are doing things better. So do. Give yourself kudos. Meditation, massage, therapy, diet, fitness programs, all favorite for you. So just take that walk, make that run, you know, be in shape. On the weekend, good exchanges with loved ones. Oh wow, you feel appreciated for once. Your magical color red, lucky numbers, nine and 36. Taurus, the full moon in your spiritual sector brings positive changes, more peace of mind, and also a sense of achieve achievement. Fight for your space, be patient. Soon you will be laughing all the way to the bank. Somehow financially also things are gonna turn out better than you thought about it. 
just let go of old ways of doing things. And in love, you definitely attract new ideas to improve the quality of your life. And also, you could certain connections you connected with, now they could come to fruition. Wow! On the weekend, friends and family definitely really f make you feel special. Your magical color, green, lucky numbers, 1 and 37. Gemini, Gemini, the full moon in your social sector bring popularity, goodwill, and also protection. Think out of the box. Complete, cooperate, work with others is the theme of the week. Be fair, honest, and all of this will be returned to you tenfold. I'm telling you, make things right this week. You attract also healing in your personal life and breakthroughs in career because of your goodwill. And if you want to lose weight, get back in shape, take initiative, you'll definitely get results quite easily. Just don't wait. Remember, waiting is about the losing the weight. You're not losing the weight, you're losing the waiting. On the weekend, sensi sensitivity is pretty high, so get in touch with your soul and listen to what your higher self is telling to you. Meditation, yoga, all spiritual activities favored. Your magical color orange, lucky numbers 2 and 11. Cancers, ta-da, that's me. The full moon, your ruler, in your career sector brings you new ideas on how to conquer your dreams. In personal life, you may be pulled in different directions. You're sort of learning new things about yourself, but follow your heart, not your mind. At home, have faith. Be calm. Things will turn out just fine. Something you worry about is nothing to worry about, okay? In love, go with the flow and smile. Have faith. Your flexibility, your patience, your understanding will bring the desired results. In career, think greatness. Be a leader. Do things your way, okay? And your creativity is pretty amazing this week. So if you're an artist, a musician, uh, in show business, you will do really, really well. And you could it's all about making your masterpiece this week. In love and everywhere you go. On the weekend, you feel loved and appreciated and it feels so good. Your magical color pink, lucky numbers, 1 and 21. Leos, the full moon in your karmic sector brings confidence, high energy, and a sense of duty. You are closer to a major accomplishment. I don't know what it is, but you will know it. Be proud. The public likes also the way you handle yourself and the difference you make everywhere you go. A good time to reflect on certain powerful events that happened in your life for the last two, three months and see how it brought you where you are this week. Royalty awaits. Wear your crown high. That's what I tell you. And on the weekend, satisfaction of being who you are is definitely in your heart. And you'll be able to say, mission accomplished. ta -da! Your magical color red and lucky numbers 4 and 31. Virgos, the full moon in your shell resources sector brings higher energy recognition and also applause. Be proud and say yes to a lot of things that are proposed to you. The focus is also on confidence. Try new things, experiment, uh, promote new ideas, sell yourself. You see also people and situations in your life for what they really are and how they affect you and able to make right choices. On the weekend, you can give a psychic advice or live a psychic experience. Your magical color blue, like in numbers 5 and 41. Ta-da! And now here's the wizard affirmation of this very beautiful orange, spectacular harvest full moon that makes us so romantic. Well, the universe in life does not always give me what I want, give you what you want, but it always gives me what I need, and it does give you what you need. Put that in your pipe <laughs> and smoke it. Love you guys, have fun and be romantic all week, and always remember, never too late to do the right thing. And thank you for all your likes, all your feedback, and all your love, and all your huggies, and all your beautiful texts, and everything, and Messenger, and Facebook, and Twitter, and everywhere. And if you need advice, you want to do a phone call, please, I'm there for you at your service, always. Bye, Jose. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.